Look over my shoulder and watch as I create a 30 second nature observation for nature's wild things. See my workflow process for transforming raw video footage into something that's ready for publishing. Okay, let's look at our raw video today. Today we'll be using Final Cut Pro X on a Mac. And we've got a raw video clip here of, um, I believe they're called web worms. Uh, these are the larvae or the uh, caterpillar stage of a moth. And they like to congregate together in their own little nest. And uh, let's see what we have to work with today. We have a video clip here that's about uh, a minute long. It looks like I was hand holding the camera and this was up in a tree. And uh, when you're hand holding, you get uh, all sorts of uh, camera movement here. In addition to those little caterpillars crawling all around. And so we're going to need to do some image stabilization here on this video clip. And let's scrub through and just find uh, options for a 30 second video out of, out of all the, the clip here. And uh, we can take and create a real time video. Or if we want to, we can take a smaller portion of video and uh, slow it down a little bit so we can really see the action of what's going on. Here's, here's one little caterpillar that I seem to be following with the camera here. Not always totally in focus, but comes in right about let's go a couple frames here get them in focus looks like right about there he's in focus and he we lose focus at one point there but there's so much to see around the the photo that is in focus it's uh, gonna be interesting to watch and hard to watch for some people. That's about the end of the clip, right? There it goes out of focus. So let's make that the out. And let's take this and move this to our timeline. The timeline is where we fine tune the, the video. And we're we're going to just play this. I want to just see what we've got in real time here. Focus a little bit right there. He comes in focus. That's just a little over 30 seconds, but uh, let me scrub down through here. Out of focus, out of focus. Right there, he comes back into focus. So let's, let's take and uh, make that our, that our clip there. And let's look at what we've got. Now we've got about 17 seconds now so we've got our little guy just wandering around inside his little nest there actually looks like he's gonna climb out and escape <laughs> beautiful shot of the long hairs on his back
like in that little clip. Let's select that clip and let's adjust the duration of this clip to 30 seconds here. Now that's going to have the effect of slowing it down to give us slow motion so we can better observe the technique he's using for crawling and moving around and uh, moving his head around. It's going to allow the eye to also wander and look at all the movement and what's happening in the background. Just uh, also seeing a little bit of camera shake in the whole video here too. He goes out of focus then it's like he comes to the top and comes in focus. Yeah, okay. Uh, let me see here. We didn't have the end of the clip in the frame. So there we come over the top. There he goes out of focus. All right, let's uh, turn on the video options here. Let's see what we can do with our our little. I mean, if I scrub through quick, you can see uh, there's a little bit of shaking movement going on there. Let's see if we can stabilize this clip and uh, watch the progress on the stabilization up here transcoding and an analyzing the data and then we're going to re-render the entire video and at the re-render means that it's going to uh, take the motion out for us a little bit and uh, it is impressive with all the motion that's going on on the screen it's taking out the camera shake and it usually does a pretty good job let's see what it does in a minute here we're about three quarters done and uh, we're almost there all right when we okay so let's look at our video real time here and, and uh, uh, press the wrong button. Start over again. All right, caught in the beginning there. Okay, let's look at this video. So we've uh, really taken out some of the shaking now. look at this Oop. there we go moving around again uh, let's see crawling 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 I'm just looking at uh, the shot wondering if any cropping will help but then we would lose <laughs> what's going on all around him and I think I want to be able to have the viewer watch what's going on around him too since we're not entirely just wanting to focus on this one little creature we want to see all the creatures there moving around and doing their thing so all right let's put a dissolve at the end so we can uh, let's find the dissolves here and there we go there's the cross dissolve that we want let's move the this back into where we can see the end and we'll just apply that 
Let's see if the default amount of time. There we go. That looks pretty good. All right. So we've stabilized it. Uh, let's take the audio off. When we slow things down, audio just becomes <laughs> unusable. So we'll take it out here in this case. And uh, I think we have a 30 second video.